thank Arvo you're here, sir. The situation is bad, sir, real bad. The bandits are demanding protection money from the traders' union and took three hostages to show they mean business. The union's refusing to pay up, even though today is the last day. They called me because I owed them a favor, but, well, I just got out of guard college last week and I only got a C minus in hostage recovery. Know what? I'll tell you where they are and leave you to it. Let me see. Uh, oh, yes, now there's uh, there's one's down the hill and uh, there's two more on the other side of them big gates. All clear? Right. I'm going to make a tactical withdrawal before they see me. <laughs> All right. Uh, good luck. Don't worry, though, a C is still a pass. Right, welcome back to a tale of a hero. We've got straight into the action today because I didn't realise it was going to start as soon as we got to uh, the bandit camp, but yes, we are. So what happened on our last adventure? Well, we killed the bandit king. Uh, we didn't kill him. We defeated him in battle, single combat. Uh, then he was uh, pushed aside. You know, the bandits didn't follow him anymore because we beat him. We showed him who's boss. Uh, we found our sister, who was with the bandits here. She was not dead, and she gave us a power. We don't know what that power is yet. We bought a bordello, uh, we didn't buy a bordello, we uh, acquired a bordello as well as some legendary weapons. And it was one other thing which was we got the mission to go to the Witchwood to help the architect. But first we've got a side mission to do which is to save the bandits as we do bandits, save the traders from the bandit camp as we're doing right now. Let's get on with it. Rescue all three traders held captive in the bandit camp. In information, no boasty. I didn't take any because I want to kill loads and I don't want to rush it so let's do it. Because obviously now these bandits have gone rogue. They were okay because they were had a leader, but they uh, changed their mind in the end. Now they're now they've sort of turned back to the dark side. Damn minute, you! You think of freeing them traders? I'm gonna cut you up. Come on then, cut me up, boy! I'll slice me up a piece of bandit. A nice juicy piece of bandit. Oh, nom, 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 nom. I mean, I have still got my legendary weapons I could use, but I'm not going to. I want to wait a bit first. Cool. Right, yeah, so the plan is to get in here, save the uh, traders. I don't think so. I am. You may have lost all of your sense of code of honour when your bandit king was defeated. Tonight our bandits go bad. Not anymore. Right, so what have we got? We've got bandits. How would you have done this without killing anybody? Oh my god, look at them all. There's thousands of them. There's literally thousands. Yes, I am thinking of freeing the traitors. Traitors, come, Sword of Tommy. Fight by my side. Or oh, are you actually little Tommy? I can't tell. I think you're actually little Tommy. I think you actually are. You are. <laughs> well, you can start fighting them, mate, whenever you're ready, buddy. Nope, I'm feeling alright, actually, mate. Could use some spells. Did we they just kill one of them? Who's that on the floor? Oh, it's a bandit. Never mind. That's cool. Come on, Chief Tommy. We'll burn the bodies. Unless you want them coming back. Nice. How many's left? So who's dead? Let me out of who? Right. Hold on. Let me make sure the coast is clear, whoever said that. What? Need someone to watch your <laughs> no, Bower. I do not. God, that was strange. He's just, he's just still here trying to sell himself. Right, where is it? Oh, no, it's frozen again. No, it's not. It's cool. Get me out of here. It's all right, man. You, you're from the guild. Rescued at last. Those bandits are a vicious bunch. You have to get me out. Uh, I see you got to stick with me, have you? All right, that's not a problem, buddy. That's not a problem. We, I'll, you can stay with me. Right, don't need you because you're useless. Right, pushing forward. Come on, my friend. We're moving forward into the upper camp. Fantastic. All right, lad. I'm going to scout ahead. You wait here. Wait. Did you get that? You got that. Cool. Right, so while I'm going to go deal with these bandits, I'm going to focus on... Um, Spells now. I'm going to sort of alternate in between each one. 
Oh, I know what I'm going to do. Oh my god, I haven't done it yet. Uh, where is it? I'm going to use Divine Fury. This spell is absolutely fantastic. Right, first we need to get a, a bunch of guards. Bunch of guards. Come on, guys. Come with me. Come with me if you think you're hard enough. Come on, up here as well. Come on. Follow me. Oi, guards. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, you bandits. You call yourself bandits. You're sitting by a fire. You're like a little bunch of schoolboys. Rain justice down upon them. From above. Oh my god, look at how powerful this is. Are they all dead? They're not all dead. And again. Mighty Avo. Bestow the power of destruction upon me. They're still not dead. And again. I seem to remember somebody saying this was a very overpowered spell. It's not as powerful as you think. Oh, it does it does stop them from moving towards you, so that's actually a good idea. Quick. Ah, stuff it. And again, why not? Justice down from above. No one shall withstand the might of Avo. Oh, bloody hell. I think the direct quote was it was powerful. <laughs> oh, it was actually, in fact, two people said that. <laughs> cool. Right, that's that done then. Uh, they all dealt with. Oh, it's all dealt with. That's okay. It's not too bad then. Do I get power? I didn't get any. Um, I didn't get any XP from that, did I? Oh, I'm not. I don't like that spell. I changed my mind. Okay, what we got instead? Let's go with some new spells. Um, we've got Turncoat, which is not a good spell. It's it makes you go evil. But what I'm going to do? Uh, did it work? It did not work. He's coming towards me. Why is he coming towards me? Join me, evil one. Bloodbending. Go and fight these villains. Right, yeah, I'm trying to get a trophy. Um, this is this is a bad spell, unfortunately. But I want this guy to, to kill one of them. Where's he gone? Why are you sitting down? Come over to my side, evil villain. It's already started. <laughs> Bloodbending. That's it, that's it. That's it, and a little bit more. Just take him out. That's it, bandit. That's it, that's it, that's it. I can't see what's happening. Kill him. Destroy him. Kill him. Kill him. No. You killed You killed him. Right. Join me, bandits. Join me. Join me, I say. Why is he not joining me? There he goes. Right, now we'll try and let him kill this guy. Just so that I can get the trophy. Achievement. Sorry. Thanks, box. Ding dong. Yes, there it is. That's cool. Thank you for your services. Now die. Great. Is he dead? He's not dead. Now he is. Cool. No, right, that's, no, that's that done. Sorry about that. Just want to get that trophy before I forget. Achievement. I'm so sorry to every Xbox player in the world. Right. Anyway, cool. Let's carry on then. So right, the plan is to try and unlock that gate for some reason. Is to save these bandits and stuff like that. But save the bandits, save the traders. Oh, I am, mate. Have some thunder. I'm actually going to do this as well, and this, and this again. Right, slow down time. Oh, what's this one? Battle charge? Was that? Oh, it is. Oh, cool. Let's see what it does. <laughs> Quite fun, actually. What else have we got? What else have we got? Probably my best attack spell is still probably this one. Right. I know I'm going to get in a dead end of it here, but at least I can see what they're doing. Oh, it's funny. He's made a pun. Very punny of you, Mr. Twader. He said infernal. I'm using a, a fire spell. My spells are not that powerful. I need to start upgrading some. I think. I think that's what. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to start upgrading either my lightning or my fireball. I think my fireball because I like my fireball. God, why won't you die? I said I'm going to use my spells. Actually, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to summon little Tommy. That's turncoat. Where is it? I don't even know which one it is. Is it that one? I've got no. It. Will. Come on, Tom. Chief Tom, switch back to this one for a fireball at him. And we'll sort of both do it at both the same time, alright? 
That's it. Well done. No, because there's one left. Look. Idiot. Oh my god, that, that guy died so much quicker than the other guy. Sweet. All right then, Tway to Joe. I suppose I should thank you. Took your precious time. You have no idea how long I've been waiting to be rescued. We can't stand here all day talking, though. we got to leave now. Never a happy customer. Come with me, mate. I need to store you over... In fact, there's not many guys down here. How many guys are down here? There's only one guy left, so I might... Thunder and shock him! As I'm walking past him. Don't stand in front of my lightning. <laughs> we learn the hard way what happens when that happens. Sweet, cool. That's it, All right. Follow me, Mr. Twader Joe. I'll put you with Twader Joe as well. All right, wait here. Wait. Cool. What was that sound? I don't, I don't know. All right, now there's someone down here. Who is this? How many? All right, I would do a bit of Infernal Wrath. In fact, let's be clever here. Let's do this. Wait, bring them a bit closer down here so they don't get hit by my... Right, okay, let's do this. So knock him down. Switch it, switch it. And then rain fiery justice down from the skies. I know they're not dead, but it's good enough. They're a bit less, they're a bit more dead than what they were. That's why I did it. All right, gonna use that whirlwind of energy in a minute. Now he's back again. <laughs> Infinite potions. I say infinite. Oh my god, they take forever to kill. I seriously need to upgrade some of my spells. I think they're too weak. At least, uh, at least I'll learn that from this endeavor adventure. Right. Oh my god. <laughs> nice one. Can you get me out of here now, please? I, I think I can. There. I can get you out. Ah, my savior. You have come to rescue me, haven't you? <laughs> Excellent. Uh, it's just that sometimes you uh, guild types uh, like to chop our heads off instead. <clears throat> anyway, uh, let's go. I understand. After all, Twinblade was a hero. Have we done it all then? In fact, what's up there? What is this up here? What is this? It's the Fist Fighters group. Oh my god, I would do that. But A, I'm on a mission. And B, it's nearly daytime, so that they'll disappear in a second. Okay, then, you ungrateful... Follow. Hostages? No? Follow. I'm not sure. Right, so that is that actually everybody? Um, How do I check my uh, quest goals? It was three traders, wasn't it? Uh, trader rescue, here we go. All three of the traders have captive... Okay, I guess I just... Go away now, then, do I? I guess so. Right, come on then, traders. We're moving off. No, we, we don't get a team name. I'm just trying to think of one. I'm not, we, don't, we don't get one. You're hostages. You're not... We're not a team. We're not a fellowship. You are hostages. Hostages. Right, then. We're nearly home three. Let's get you in here. Wait for it to happen. Right. I have returned. Mr. Guard, are you here? Or do I have to actually leave... Do I have to actually go with these guys? Can I just go on the... Can you use, can you use the portcullis gate? They don't say. Alright, let's leave then. Oh, shit. It feels good to be free again, I can tell you that. Ah, oh, thanks. Asher, you're a splendid fella. I'll be sure to give you a discount on my wares if I ever see you again. Way trade a rescue. Uh, nice, all pretty good. Right then. You are now renowned enough to use the bloodlust raw expression. Bloodlust raw. You have but reached famous, famous status. status. Everybody's famous. Du, 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 famous. Where's the bloodlust raw? Here we go. Ha! Oh. <laughs> It's unfortunate. Okay, right now I'm going to go back. I've got two quests to do in Twinblade's camp. So I'll go and do them and then I'll be back and have a little party. I don't know if that's actually what we're going to be doing, but I've decided. We'll do something like a party. Back to the elite camp. 
All right, okay, so we'll just wait for this guy to get back here. And there's only one thing we need to do here. I mistakenly wrote down the wrong place on my guide. So it's just one more thing we have to do. All right. And I like the, I like the fact that I remember said that the king, the bandit king, is dead. <coughs> and now there's no one to control the bandits, so they've all got, like, the bandits have, like, gone, the, like, the, yeah, bandits gone bad, they've gone bad sort of thing. Oh dear, he got knocked out. But yeah, anyway, we're going to speak to this guy. Who is this? Now, I'm the head of this fist fighters gang. I see you've clashed before. You're in. You up for a bit of a scrap. To take part, you'll need 50 gold. You'll get gold for every round you win. And even more if you can avoid getting hit. You can lose by taking too many hits or stepping out of the ring. You might be a powerful hero, but this is a contest of skill. Our punches might not hurt you much, but they still count. So, do you want to test your metal? I do rind, or rind, rind probably. Um, yeah. Anyway, I was saying about the bandits. I like the fact that we sort of like, they've all gone bad, so now we have to sort of we have to deal with them. You know. Anyway, all right, pay rind fifty gold. Get ready. The punchin's about to start. What's with the changing of the accent, man? You go Newcastle or Liverpool? No, it's not Liverpool. Liverpool's different. Right, let's try and do this without getting hit. Alright. Hit once, back away. Hit twice. Oh, that was easy. Struth, you hurt me. Tonight on Bandit's Gone Bad. The Bearded Bandit, formerly known as the Bearded Bandit, starts a, bo a bar fight in the middle of a ring. Oh, shut up, rhymed. Thumping with your fists. That's right, that's right indeed. That's it. No. I can still take him, Joe. Send me back in the ring. So far, so good. And this is when it starts to get a little bit dangerous. Like, they start doing like two hits. Like, they start going like, ugh, ugh. Boot to the face, nice. Don't boo me, you lost fair and square. Do you not see my magical tattoos? Actually, I can't see my magical tattoos. Probably because my arcane powers have been deactivated for this fight. Thump him! It's man on man dueling in the mud. Oh dear, look at that dodge! That dodge. It was luck more than anything, though. Don't worry. <laughs> I'm not trying to sound big-headed. It was luck. Oh, my God. Come on, Rind. You scared? You're sending in the weaklings. I want the master. I say weaklings. He's probably going to hit me. Easy. Oh, no. I was so close to winning. Oh, dear. Oh, my God. He's nearly killed me. One more shot and I think I'm down. Remember, it's not about the health. It's about how much they hit you. Looks like four hits and I've done. They did knock me on the floor. Oh my god, this guy's tough. I'll take care of you myself. Sorry, I was quiet there. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Dawn is fast approaching. I wonder what happens if I block. Does he get through my blocking? Get on the floor, Rind. That's right. Come on, then. Come on, you spiky-haired loser. I will. Let's do it. That's it. Stay down. Stay down, man. My punch is... Just keep pushing. I did it. That makes you the new champion. Fist fighter level three passed. Nice work, guys. And now they all flee before the morning sun. Cool. There's no bandits. There doesn't seem to be bandits around anymore. It's really weird. Right, anyway, that's that done. I'm going to go back to the guild now. Um, 
Why am I doing that? I could just do this. Yeah, because I want to go back and uh, spend some experience points. So, Heroes Guild, off we go then. Let's leave these bandits to their own devices, shall we? Goodbye. Oh, we're back. Back in the guild. I don't think we've got a lot of XP. I'm naked from the waist up. <laughs> I've just realised. Yeah, I haven't got much XP, but we can get some things. All right. I don't want to spend my green if I can help it. Actually, how much have we got? 12 divided by 2, say. Um, that's 6,000. So I can go 6,000 plus what I've got. 15,000. That's quite a lot, actually. Uh, toughness. Physique is always my favourite. So I want to try and get some big weapons. Oh, that's a lot, though. I might leave that off now and just get some health instead. And then how much is that again? That's 9,000. I'll save that one for later, then. Let's go to... I should have much XP. This. I don't. I can only buy Guile, and that's how much is that? That's 10,000. So, oh, it takes a lot away. Should I buy some Guile? It gives me better prices, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Do I have anything left for this? I want to upgrade some weapons. In fact, I want to upgrade Fireball. Fireball is actually my proper favourite, I think. So, let's upgrade that. Can I upgrade it again? I might do it again. Can I? I can I do anything else? I would like to upgrade uh, Summon if I can. I think that's a lot. Actually, no, I think that's quite a bit of uh, cash. I think that's too much money. I can actually get it, though. What does it do? Um, uh, high levels allow Crocus to Summon for longer. Meh. <laughs> well, I've done it now. Cool, right, so now we've only got... We can, buy, can we buy some more stuff here? Buy some more health? No, I can't buy anything else there, then. That's unfortunate. Okay, we'll just spend some more of this stuff if I can. Uh, can I upgrade my lightning? Can I multi-strike? I can buy multi-strike though, but I don't know if that's the one I want to buy. In flame. I want to try to upgrade stuff if I can. Force push would be good to upgrade, I suppose. Drain life would be, I suppose, as well. Berserk, I don't have Berserk. Assassin Rush, I don't have Berserk. Okay. Let's buy upgrade uh, force push. Cool. And now I've got not a lot else. No. Cool. Okie dokie then. There's my tattoos back. Still don't like them. <laughs> okay, now, what to do? I'm not sure. I'll decide while I'm uh, changing my work, my costume. Oh, my God, I know I know what I'm doing. I'm going down here. I haven't been down here before, yeah? Yeah, there was these two bookcases here once before in the Guild Library. And uh, we found out that now they've been moved across. And now it's a passageway into, I might say, the oldest part of the Guild, the Guild Caves. I can't no music. Yeah, it's a very short transition period here. But if we go into here, this is where the ceremony took place, or where I graduated. I can't believe I haven't been in here yet. But we're going in now. I can't, I can't remember what this is called, but I know it's it's important. The Chamber of Fate. It's like a, it's like a cathedral or a chapel. And what that? There's some stink. There's some pictures on the walls. I've seen that before. That is an image of my life. The Chamber of Freight shows your life. Past, obviously, not present or future. Yes, yeah, so that's obviously the, the Oakvale Raid. Nothing on that one yet. What's this one? Oh, that's my sister's. And her past that we've just had. There's one more down here. Is this where I graduated from the guild? It is. Oh, look at that scene. They all start to show up here later. So you can see there's quite a lot of story elements to go then. The game's not that long though. We're nearly finished, if I'm honest. I said, oh, nearly finished? Not nearly finished, but we're close to being finished. Right, I still don't know what to do, Um, but that's done. So I'll go and find something else to do now then. So I'll be back in a second. And here we are. Come to Barrowfield. Look at that. Now, don't worry. I'm not come here to massacre them like that quest was. That's an evil quest, which we won't be doing. There is a gold, there's a gold thing. I always say gold. It's because quests are usually gold. There's a green dot on the map. You might remember what it is. It's to buy the blue mushroom. And I figured we've got a lot of money now. I might as well get it and get that quest over and done with. Because this is the last one to have to get. And we can't steal it because it's impossible. Nice Trust me. Tea. I've tried. Are you looking for blue mushrooms? Then you've come to the right place. Pretty popular items, I can tell you. I've only got one left now. Sold one to a trader near the guild. And then the other two. Let me think. Oh, yes. 
One went to a rather miserable woman, likes to hang around the picnic area. The other went to a fellow who said he was throwing a party in the guild woods. So, are you interested? Demand is high, supply is low, so I can't take anything less than 1,500 gold. Uh, I'll buy that. It's an extortionate price, I might add, but have I got a trade of moustache on? Thank you. Enjoy, my good man. We've actually got them all now, then. Have I got a... No, I think it's... Oh, no, it's just it's just my beard, I think. Oh, look at that. You see, now I'm good enough. I've got myself a halo. Look at that. I've got a halo. i got a halo. Halo. Oh, my God, look how much money I've got. I've got 14 grand. Oh, my Lord. No. No. Um, Guild seal. There we go. Oh, and butterfly as well. Cool. Right, so now I'm going to go back to Bowerstone, give these things to the witch, and then we will be on our merry little way to help the sick child. Away we go to Bowerstone, and we'll pop by my house as well. Just to... Here we are, Bowerstone South. Now, I should have just done it from Bowerstone Quay, but I didn't. Are you going to help my brother Aldi then? Literally just what I've come back for, yes. Right, so what's actually left? We've got the lady around the corner. What's in here? Looking to hire a swordsman. No, evil bandit. There's a minstrel down there. I feel like, just because other games I've played, the minstrels always have like interesting little stories, like uh, Quaver from, uh, or the Quaver or the Jester from uh, the Overlord series. And he, I always feel like I should listen to them. But that, that guy there is just he is just not good at all, is he? So I don't think I shall. Right. Kick the chicken. That was a nice little kick. I kicked him over the fence. And then we'll go to Barrowstone Quay. Oh, we're back. Good for that. Cool. So where's this witch? Witch! I've bought you your mushrooms. Give the mushrooms to the witch. Ah, oh, yes. Good. <laughs> These will be perfect. Uh, just give me a few hours and, uh... Well, what do you know? I've got some of the potion already. <laughs> Mind like a sieve, I tell you. Which is potion? What's it say? Made from mushrooms given to by which? I'll hang on to these mushrooms if it's all the same to you. I'll just, um, uh, uh put them somewhere safe. <laughs> yes, uh, bye now. You druggy? That's the word, isn't it? Yeah, <laughs> I couldn't remember what they, were, what they were called when they take drugs. Okay, right, back to Bowstone South, and we'll give it to little Oldie. Okay, right, before we do that, I just want to go and check the school. Now, I know you've seen the pointing episodes. I've already given loads of things to the book, or loads of all the books to them, uh, the uh, the students and stuff like that. But there's one I want to particularly look at. There's one book about, it tells the tale of Archon. Oh, Archon? We've got his crossbow. Basically, he was in a town that was attacked by bandits, um, and then he became the ruler of all of Albion, or the Old Kingdom as it's called, and he had this magical sword, the Sword of Aeons, did it say? And um, yes, he was a good thing, he was a good leader, but then he sort of got corrupted in the end and turned out like the Mad King, I suppose you could say, from Game of Thrones or something like that. So it's a bit weird, because in a, he was in a bandit raid as a child, and his family was slaughtered, and he trained, much like me... So I'm thinking that my story is I am Archon Reborn. I feel like that's my story. Anyway, I just wanted to say that. And we've only got two books left to give to him. So I'm going to go and see if I've got those books now. Excuse me, guard. Excuse me, guard. Oh, <laughs> thanks. I was going to go around the other way. There's two doors. Right then, Mr. Gout. Ah, hello again. Have you found any interesting reading material? Hope so. Good Lord! It's Lady Grey's diary. Where did you find that? On second thoughts, don't tell me. I don't want anything to do with it. Yay! Anything else? Oh, do you have a donation there, hero? The Book of Spells. Fine. Okay, no, we don't have any more books then. There's still two more that we need. Thank you. Right then, so now that we've done that, we got only got one more thing left to do here in Bowerstone, and it's actually worked out okay. I was trying to, because I want, because for the last few episodes of the last few last few hundred, uh, 
Fable Blade videos. My videos have been getting like 45 minutes long and that's that's too long. Like I like to keep them about 30 minutes. So today is what was going to happen. I'm going to do this quest here and then I'm going to end it and then we'll go on to the story next time. So yeah, uh, hopefully you're, you're okay with that. Hello then, Mother of Aldi. I have the potion from the witch. Uh, give the witch's cure to the woman. Yes. I still can't believe the old woman really helped us. I'll never join another witch-burning mob after this. We won't forget your kindness, hero. Good luck with your quests. Nah, she'd probably still join one of those burning things. And I like the fact we've just helped out someone that looks exactly like the bully from the first beginning of the game. But alas, that is how these things work. Right, so I'm a little bit tired now. This hero needs his beauty sleep, I think. So we're going to go back to, uh, what was it called? Pebble Pebble Grotto. That's what I've named my little house at the top here. And we're going to have a little nap. All right. So in we go then. Fully upgraded, I might add. So let's go inside here then. And here we go. So remember, my little house. It's a lovely little house. It's got my golden fish at the top there. And we'll go upstairs as well and we shall uh, end it. Right then. Well... That is it for this tale of a hero. Uh, what's this? Oh, okay. But, uh, yeah. So, a nice little segue into the next episode. We've just got the potion from the witch. And we've just dealt with the witch and everything. So, I think next time we should go to Witchwood. I just wanted to put that in there. But, yes. That is it, though. This is it for this tale of a hero. Next time, like I said, we're going to Witchwood. We'll continue on with the story. But, that is it for this page. So, if you want to turn the page on this tale of a hero, click on the next video to turn the page. Thanks.